Need some shooters to hit a target in Barclay. Of course. Be there soon. You'll move up when the old man thinks you shoot that stupid bastard. Your time is up, motherfucker. Sandra told me to reach out. I'll be happy to take care of that for you. God damn slick, I tell you. Yeah. Bigger they are. Trying to get my head down. and die in a dump. Wish there was another way. I need some of your boys in Barclay Mills. Whatever you need, brother. Help is on the way.
Jesus Christ! <laughs> I'm gonna shot you in the goddamn face. Now we're even. <laughs> Fucking asshole. Time to call Enzo. <sighs> All right. Tile this. <clears throat> yeah. Barclay Mills is gone. All of it. Who the fuck is this? Take a guess. Got a lot of nerve calling me like this. You know who the fuck I am? I know exactly who you are, Enzo. You're a mob lieutenant who's just lost control of his district. Marcano will probably end up playing you next to Michael Greco. You goddamn coward. You want me dead? Be a man. Do it yourself. I don't want you dead, Enzo. I want to make a deal. A <laughs> deal? Jesus Christ, son. You need to get your fucking head examined. You tell me who's behind the construction of Marcano's casino, and I'll do what I can to keep that WAP asshole from killing you. Why the fuck should I think you could protect me from Marcano? Look at what I did to you. Meet me at the quarry. Next time, don't let me catch you napping. Kiss my ass. Unload some cash in Barclay. Be there soon. What can I take off Better your hands? Losers. Going straight to the bank. Put the gun away. If I wanted you dead, Enzo, I wouldn't have walked through the front door. All the same, I ain't taking no chances. Hold on here. I know you. You're Lincoln Clay, right? Lived with Sammy Robinson? Went off to Nam? That's right. <laughs> Christ, son, if I'd have known that, we could have saved ourselves a whole lot of trouble. Follow me. You probably don't know this, but 
Sammy and I went way back. He was a good man. Didn't deserve what happened to him. Hell, none of y'all did. And this shit with the casino? It's a giant fuck you from Sal to every man who ever worked for him. He wants to go legit and fuck the rest of us in the process. <laughs> Guess it's well past time I fucked him back. You know Remy Duval? Sure, he's the big shot on the radio. Without him, there's no casino. He owns the land, runs a construction company, you name it. So, these are all fronts? Yeah, they're bullshit. Created a big paper trail to protect himself in case everything falls apart. And Marcano doesn't own any of the land? <clears throat> nah. It all belongs to Duval. He's no idiot. Long as it's in his name, Sal can't touch him. How do I find him? He lives up in Frisco Fields. But from what I hear... Olivia Marcano is keeping close tabs on him, forcing him to stay low. The last thing Sal needs is for his sole legitimate partner to get into trouble. We should get moving. Looks like it's a little late for that. Deal's a deal. Let's go. Pussy-ass motherfuckers used to work for me. I need someone to kill these Barclay motherfuckers. Do this. I got round the quarry. No way I'm just walking away and leaving all this to sell.
right there's the first batch. Rig that one up, then we'll move on to the rest. You weren't kidding about these explosives. That's life in a quarry. Back in the day, we tried sticking our pickers in the ground and fucking the stone out. But all we ended up with was chap nut sacks. <laughs> Got it. If I had an army of you, I'd be running this town. Assuming I'd let you. Back in the day, I'd have been out there fighting alongside of you. Or going up against you. That piece of shit ends over time. That would have been good for you, sir. I'm stuck. Give me a hand. Consider shit whole rice patties rice. beautiful, then grab a one-way ticket. But for me, it don't get ugly. Yes, you do. In my sights. the same thing to your mother.
sides, motherfucker! Okay. Yeah, why wouldn't that be? Ted, some of these men work for you. Not some of them, all of them. That should do it. Ties through here. God damn. You like? Nah, I love. Give me there and I'll make a financial contribution to your cause. They got it blocked. But I bet we can bust through the gate. What about the train tunnel? The tunnel? <laughs> it's your call. Well, the news will take your breath away. Located in the... Begging your pocket, motherfuckers. <laughs> Guess I'm retired. <laughs> this cool. is I can't see the score. I need a new TV. What's the best store? There's more snow. Uh, you you can't kill go. me. I am the cockroach. King cockroach. <laughs> Enzo, calm down, man. They can't even hear you. Fuck him in the eye. And a special view with the greatest advance in TV since color itself. I'm sure they're okay. You can use it on multiple functions. Everything from changing the channel to adjusting the volume without ever leaving your chair. I just love Holden's prices. For the latest and greatest in home entertainment, there's only one place to go. Holden's Department Store. Oh, the back of visible It's hot. It's cool. It's WBC. New When we're dropping. I got this girl, Henrietta. Shacks up at the Carousel Hotel in the Hollow. Smart as a fucking whip. I left a fucking bag with her. Should have all I need to get by. Two tears in a bucket. So, yeah, me and Sammy back in the day, we had these two knockouts. And we was drinking, partying, having the time of our lives. This was uh, 1942, no, 43. You must have been about the age you are now. And the girl with your old man, she starts getting into the making out. But she got a problem. Savage passed out cold. Told you he was drunk off his ass. But this girl was into him, so she gives him the benefit of the doubt. Keeps trying. Smacks him a bit. Wakes him up. But every time she starts getting into it, Savage drops. Poor bastard couldn't stay awake to save his fucking life. Finally, she's had enough and storms out of there, cursing a goddamn blue streak. And do you know who that woman was? Perla. Perla. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Perla didn't move to New Bordeaux until 44. I'll show you who it was. I got the photo right here.
Are you kidding me? Sammy had a shot with her. She was passing through on her way to Hollywood, but it all worked out, didn't it? Sammy wound up with Perla, the love of his life. This is good right here. Sorry again about what happened to Sammy and Ellis. Appreciate it. Take a load off, brother. Turns out there's at least one sane motherfucker in Marcano's crew. Enzo Conti backed away clean. No one's moving anything through Barclay Mills without paying up to us. I get it, brother. You came to me last time, but you still carry some doubts. Wondering how exactly a woman keeps up with a man in this world. Well, I'll tell you, with a lot of fucking bullets. I'm fine with occasionally splitting things when we gotta lock the auction down. But continuing to ask my boys to do work that's gonna put money in someone else's pocket. That's when we tread into areas I don't care for. The Irish deserve to hold on to this piece of the city. Maybe I missed the call or something, but I didn't even know you were working that part of the city. Can't go wrong here, brother. As long as you leave. Who's it gonna be, Lincoln? Remember, you asked me to be a part of this. This one's all you, Bert. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. You're smarter than your goddamn luck, lad. My men do what I tell them to do. Their loyalty is unmatched. But when you pull shit like this, that hurts me, which in turn hurts you. Better luck next time, I guess. All right, that's it. We're done for now. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. What a prick. Turns out you were right. I gotta go. Thank you for this. Happy hunting, Donovan. Miss Lancaster's helping me with a side project. You get a name at Enzo? Yeah, Remy Duval. He's not only building the casino, he also owns all the land where it's being built. Remy Duval? The jackass on the radio? His family's been down here a couple hundred years. Thinks it makes him everyone's massa. According to this, he heads up the Southern Union in his spare time. The Southern Union's basically the fucking clan. You know, right before I shipped out, Father James was with some other folks protesting the fact that the city didn't have any black cops. So the Union came in and kicked the shit out of everybody they could get their hands on. Day after, they spray-painted God hates niggers across the front of his church. If President Andrew Johnson had actually executed those traitorous fucks, we wouldn't have this goddamn problem. Enzo also mentioned Olivia Marcano. Olivia's an outlier. Old Southern money. She's the one that was married to Sal's brother, Lucho. At least until someone slit his throat. And she runs Frisco Fields. Ever since Lucho died. She expanded his drug business and opened a PCP lab. Mm. And since a lot of mafiosos live up there, she probably just has a place they can socialize. Well, it's usually in the back of some business. I never knew the mob had women as capos. She's there to keep Duval in line. Only people these entitled pricks listen to were other entitled pricks. So who are you going to go after first? Duval. Since he owns the land where the casino's being built, killing him will muddy things up. You think hitting Olivia's businesses will help draw him out? I've known racist assholes like him my entire life. Black man like me running around terrorizing white folks. He ain't gonna be able to let that stand. His pride will bring him down. Hey, you know that bourbon's not cheap. Good luck out there.
Gotta unload some of this cash in the hollow. Be there soon. How about sending some new wheels to Delray Hollow? Just gonna take a squirt, and I'll get her out to you. All right. What do we have this today? Safe. Guess our business is done here. That's a big hill. And salutations and all that shite. Long way from Point Verdun, aren't you, Bear? Decided it was time to branch out. Not really a lot for me in that organization anymore. So what's your new lie? Mind-melting narcotics. And I hear the best are coming out of Frisco. PCP. And it's cutting into my business. Okay. So where's the operation? Beats the hell out of me. But a while back, Miss Olivia Marcano hired a top-notch chemist named Bobby Bastian tasked them with upgrading our operations, which will make it impossible for the small-time cooks to compete. Hell, they even got taxis delivering their shit. If I can get to Bastion's dealers, maybe they'll give them up. Tell me something I can use against them. That ain't all. Word is Miss Marcano brought in a couple other eggheads from San Francisco. Get rid of them, and Bobby Bastion's gonna find himself nice and fucked. Bit of beating on some of Bastion's guys, and maybe they'll tell you something useful. Tell me what Bobby Bastion's up to. 
We've been moving the speed around town using taxis. Last I heard, the boss was keeping the cash drops at the dispatch garage. I'll be in touch. I'm in Frisco and I could use some supplies. Going at you. Hang tight. Anything you want here? Show me what you got. Guess what? Good. Call me if you need me. about all this uh, agitation which never seems to stop these days organizers it's that kind of no I'm not worried how you feel about the Southern Union those boys will be fine I speak for them I speak for you dear listener you know me you know my best behind our name and it's tired of this city is important to me what i'm saying what? is
in Frisco. Get somebody to take this cash off me. I'm in Frisco Fields and need some new wheels. Aye, I'll get her out to you right away. Watch it. Better not lose this. On my way. Set of hot wheels just like you ordered. Appreciate it. Asshole, this is a restricted area. Go on. Think he headed that way. Guess we put the fear of God in here. Sandra told me to reach Flip out. I certainly appreciate some help with you. I'll be happy to take care of that for you. So much blood. Fuck him I got a secret, bitch. <laughs> I'm hurt. I'm hurt over here. You're going down. God damn it. Sandra told me to reach out. I certainly appreciate some help. I'll be happy to take care of that for you. Don't like the sound of that. Your time.
PayPal. Whatever. Huh? Ain't welcome here, numb nuts. Kiss my white ass. Huh? Ain't welcome here, nuts. What the shit? Get me some cover and fire in Frisco. Nothing. On our way. Any final word? This is the way you die. I simply do not understand why they can't stay in our own neighborhood. Out of sight, out of mind. It is a death. I'm in Frisco, and I could use some supplies. I'll head your way now. You spot anything you can use? Show me what you got. OK. I'll be with that. See you later. Look at you, making it extra tough for Bobby Bastion to cook. It's been a bad couple of days for old Bobby Bastion. Far less of his product out on the street than he and Miss Marcano would like. Sounds like good news for you. I mean, that doesn't hurt. What are things looking like at the lab? Is Bastion there? Yeah, and in a fucking state. Apparently, the Marcanos aren't too happy about the cash flow disruption. Yeah. Well, let's see how they feel about losing their drug lab. And Bear, sell what you're gonna sell. But you better steer well clear of the hollow. Well, you know where to find Bastion. Go get the fucker.
Okay. See you somewhere. Get off too. First cut's mine.
got nowhere to go. Do whatever you're gonna do. Just don't leave me to Olivia. Shit. Only way we're gonna hold on to Frisco Fields is if you send some of your boys. You can't keep asking me to lock down half the district, then leave me nothing to show for it. I'll do this, but you ought to do right by me this time. It took me months to figure out that Lincoln had survived the massacre at Sammy's and was waging a war against Sal Marcano. The Bureau didn't have a file on Clay, and I wasn't aware of his military training because his service records were classified. Otherwise, I, I might have started to connect the dots after the death of Richie Doucette. 